things just got real ugly and petty in the Taylor Swift versus Katy Perry battle. Today's episode of Clever News Feed is brought to you by T-Mobile. Following Katy Perry's sassy tweet last week, Taylor Swift has officially confirmed that her Bad Blood single is all about Katy in a very blatant diss at one of her concerts. Well, the pop princess that is generally known for being the queen of sweetness has let the dogs out and a shark. Unless you were living sans cell phone and internet last week, then you definitely know that Tay and Nicki Minaj exchanged some bitter words on Twitter. Taylor later apologized for the misunderstanding, but we all bowed down to Katy Perry for calling out Tay's hypocrisy in a tweet that read, finding it ironic to parade the pit women against other women argument about as one unmeasurably capitalizes on the takedown of a woman. That was classy talk for, girl, stop saying you don't support women fighting women when your entire Bad Blood song and video are aimed at me. Well, T-Swift did not enjoy getting called out by her nemesis because during her concert in Foxborough, Massachusetts over the weekend, she got real shady. During her performance of Bad Blood, and specifically during the line, Band-Aids don't fix bullet holes, None other than Left Shark, aka a parody of Katie's Super Bowl Left Shark, made a cameo. What a blatant shot at Perry. We're pretty sure Katie has heard by now of the shark parody, but she is simply choosing to go the dignified silent route. What do you guys think? I love Tay, but this is low and unnecessary, and she is pitting two women against each other, which is totally against what she stands for. Do you guys disagree? Please let me know below or tweet me at Miriam Issa. Don't forget to subscribe, and then to find out who we think is the queen of shade in Hollywood, Click here for our latest episode of Debatable. Thank you for watching Clever News. I'm Miriam Issa, and I'll see you guys next time. Plus, click to the left to see the best weird colored celeb hair, or click right for tips on how to remove your makeup without makeup remover. It's like magic. And thanks again to T-Mobile for sponsoring today's Newsfeed episode.